pathology is important because it's the backbone of everything. Nearly 75% of the diagnoses in a hospital are made by pathology. Doctors and nurses wouldn't know how to diagnose or treat patients if pathology wasn't here delivering results. The doctors, they do depend on us. Pathology is involved at every level of the patient pathway, really. I think people tend to forget about the people that work behind the scenes. We're actually still diagnosing and treating patients. We're saving lives, essentially. A sample will arrive in 20 minutes of it being taken out of a patient. Right now, we've just received one where a patient is still currently on the table and we have to get the results to them as soon as possible so the surgeon knows what to do next. I do like the diagnosis bit. Finding out what's wrong. So why is this person in the hospital? Or why is this patient not well? I'm quite fresh out of university, so it's all kind of new to me, but I really enjoy the fact that I've gone to study something for three years and I've been able to use that knowledge straight away in my first role. I love the fact that we're actually you know, dealing with patients, we're, we're dealing with real people here. I didn't want to do medicine. I didn't want to have the face-to-face -face contact with the patients. I always had an interest in medicine, but didn't want to have to touch people, so I didn't want to be a doctor. <laughs> Becoming a doctor wasn't something that interested me. Um, I wanted to work behind the scenes. Pathology is the best place to come to if you're one of those people who likes to be challenged. If you are the kind of person who likes to solve mysteries, likes to solve puzzles, it is a good feel for that. I think you need to be able to focus on small detail and be one for like second guessing yourself. You're on the front line of knowing or having an effect on a patient's treatment. You're the first one to know what someone is suffering from. You're the first one to be able to come up with a diagnosis. We're good at putting people through their specialist portfolio. That seems something that they're really keen on here, which is really good. I think in the future, I'd quite like to do a master's and see where that takes me. They gave me the opportunity to grow from being a trainee. And at the moment, they are pushing me further. So right now I'm at a point where they have enrolled me into a master's course. So hopefully I am able to become a biomedical scientist based in microbiology. I just love Bristol. I think it's always a place I wanted to live eventually. I love the actual city itself. I love the area. I think it's a really, really welcoming city. It's just got a really nice feel to it. It doesn't feel too big. It doesn't feel too small. All the nicest places in England are on the doorstep. Honestly, one of the, one of the best cities I've ever lived in, definitely. It's actually amazing working in this building. Like, this hospital is such a lovely place to come to work every day. Everything works really well. There's enough space. We have immunology, hematology, microbiology, genetics. Everything is here. It means that all of the clinical scientists can get together easier and like management can get together easier. We are just one huge team. It's nice that we can all actually communicate with each other. It speeds along the whole kind of patient care process, to be honest. NBT has become one of the places to be because everyone and everything is here that you need. I'm a medical lab assistant and I save lives every day. I'm a consultant histopathologist and I save lives every day. I'm a medical lab assistant in the histology department and I save lives every day. I'm a biomedical scientist specialising in microbiology and I save lives every day.